Hey, hey, hey guys, it's Civic Dude, and you just caught me in the middle of digging the most boring thing to watch in Minecraft. But it's okay, because this is something we're going to enjoy once we get done. And yes, I finally, after I don't know how many episodes of promising, finally working on the enchanting room to get some enchants for my tools and my, s my weapons, my armor. Okay. So, let's see how am I doing this. I'm, uh, you can see I'm putting this directly across from the tree farm. No particular reason, I just thought it would be a good place for it. The tree farm, by the way, I had to redesign some made it a little bit bigger and I'm gonna put the pine trees uh, through here once I get that dug out but uh, I added some glowstone at the top and the ceiling there and some half slabs to cap off the height of the trees kinda works out pretty nice they come out very very uniform and orchard like in their growth um, works out nicely by the way the glowstone took me forever to gather the uh, the place that I'm at in the nether is not overpopulated with glowstone, per se. So, anyways, I, uh, man, I've had one of those nights today, guys. Uh, I'll get into that in a little bit, though. It's just one of those things where life kind of gets, gets to be a little bit much. Anyways, um, let's see. Oh, I wanted to show you guys what else I've done. You'll notice at the end of this hallway here, well let me go back here, I'll show you. I've done a few things. Okay, so here's where we are normally, regular part of the base. At the end of the hallway, I dug out a little room, put in a T flip flop and some pistons, and made myself finally a bedroom place to rest my head at night and I, wire, I wired up these uh, redstone lamps to turn off when the door closes and you may be saying well what civic dude you better watch out mobs are gonna spawn well I took care of that too uh, everything is half slabs even these in the corners these are upside down half slabs these are half slabs these are stairs and these are upside down half slabs Therefore, nothing can spawn in here. Not even flippin' Enderman. So, anyways, just a basic chest right here with not much. <laughs> so that's, uh, that's where I've been sleeping lately. I also dug out this area over here for the enchanting room. And I'm still digging it out. But, uh, oh, I want to show you guys something else. You guys remember my mining outpost where I've uh, set up a very tiny strip strip uh, strip mine? Well, I have a secret access to it. So, if this were an SMP map, this would be a lot more fun and uh, funny. But, anyways, I have this unsuspecting wall here with a pressure plate, and when you walk over it, piston opens, and nothing happens. Oh, until you fall down. And a th I have a three block water break there. And look at this. I'm right right at my strip mine. That worked out way better than I could have planned. I was just hoping to be within you know 20 or 30 blocks, but literally within 10 or 15 blocks here is way better than what I've hoped for. So what's going on down here? Not a whole lot. I'm kind of trying to dig this out a little bit make it more of an actual mine and I'm gonna put in some minecart rails and we're gonna cont continue this on for a long way eventually but I haven't done too much work on this yet it's just it's just kind of something I'm doing to pass the time when I don't want to do anything else what the how did you get down here that is the weirdest thing why is there a sheep down here I guess there's dirt, but there's no grass. Don't they have to have grass to spawn? That is weird. 
I had no idea about that, guys. Okay, so... I don't know if I've showed you guys the ends of my branch mines here, but they're kind of boring. I've capped them all off anyway, so there's not much to show. Okay, so... Sad news is I don't have an upward quick access. So we just have to take the long way back. But that's okay. It's not that long. Okay. So, back to what I was talking about earlier with life and stuff. Man, most of you probably do not know, but my wife and I have two kids, and they're both under the age of two. My son is just about two, and my daughter is almost four months old. And for those of you who don't have kids... Zombie, where are you? For those of you who don't have kids, they can be a handful. They can be a big handful. Especially when they're both really young at the same time. Um, and today was just one of those days where my daughter did not refuse refused to go to sleep. Normally she'll be in bed uh, a little bit before midnight and sleep through the night, but man, today she is just not not cooperated on that end. Oh, anyways, for those of you who have kids and uh, you'll know what I'm talking about, babies they get this they get the, they have this certain cry and it's not really a cry so much as it is a all out yell and scream but anyways she was doing that for at least an hour and I love my kids and my daughter and my son because that's all of my kids <laughs> I love my kids don't get me wrong but man when they cry like that there gets to be a point where you just have to set them down and walk away for a few minutes otherwise you will drive yourself insane so that's how that's how my evening is gone. A little bit rough, but that's okay. There's ways to relax after that. Branch mining is one of those for me. Another way I like to relax is put in a good movie with my wife and just sit there on the couch and not do anything but stare at the TV. <laughs> uh, I don't know how you guys are, but man, zoning out in front of the TV is awesome sometimes and I apologize if my voice is kind of raspy this is way later in the evening than I normally record but like I said when you have kids things go crazy and so this was the only time today I've had to record so I will give you my best though it may be raspy okay let me go make some more some more tools do I have any sticks Use your stick. Okay, let's see. There we go. Perfect. Ooh. Yeah, okay. So I guess I can show you guys the wiring for this... This uh, doorway here. It's not really anything super special. Okay. Now... Let us let us go down here. Okay, pressure plates are above this block right here, both of them. They feed into this redstone wire, which goes down into this concealed T-flip flop. You can see the other end of it over there. Oh crap! I just broke it. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so the T-flip flop does its thing. Power comes out here, and it goes up this wire on the left here to power the left pistons like so like that and let's see I think right here I have where do I have it oh crap I just bro I just broke it dang it how did I do this I think it's like that. Yeah. There we go. Okay. So, let's see. 
power goes into the T-flip flop, hits the whetstone, the whetstone, and powers the pistons. Do 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 do. Just like so. Oh crap. And the same thing on the other side, really. Okay. Um, that is all. Okay, so... Oh, wait. I need more. More wood. More wood. Okay, back to digging. Oh, man, I've had so much gravel right here. Okay, so if any of you guys know what I'm talking about with this kind of a... Or if you've had something similar, a frustrating kind of day, let me know in the comments, man, or send a video response or something, because frustrating days are not fun. They kind of get to you after a while. Oh. Okay, let's see. Oh, man, I hope I can get this right. I have not... <laughs> Sad to say it, guys, but I have not actually ever made an enchanting table. So I might have to go to the wiki. On film. Just to find out how to make an enchanting table. That's very sad, I know, but we will press on. <laughs> and it's not that big of a deal, really. It's not a big deal. Come on, guys. It's just a wiki. Okay, so I don't really have a design laid out for this room yet. Um, I know I want it to eventually make a uh, automated, or not not automated, a piston selector system, kind of like uh, if any of y'all have seen MC Crawl's enchanting room in his hardcore Let's Play. He has a uh, piston selector system where uh, he hits a button and the pistons will either move the bookcases up or down to provide different levels of enchantment for him. And, excuse me, I need a drink. So, anyways, he will hit a button and the bookshelves will either pop down and up or just pop up or be nothing there. That way there's a three levels, three selections of enchantments that he can choose from. But for now, I think I'm just going to put basic bookshelves there just to get it working. Because even basic enchantments will speed up my digging processes. And seriously, look how big this patch of gravel is. Okay, if no one knows the trick, the trick to get rid of gravel quickly is to dig place a torch. That way the gravel will break upon impact. See? Just like so. So, have you guys been uh, following the Ultra Hardcore series that the Minecraft guys are playing? Episode 3 just came out today. I have not seen it yet, so don't spoil it for me. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. I'll have already seen this, seen it by the time I upload this video. Oh, sorry, guys. I did not mean to do that on camera. Allergies are bad today. I don't even have allergies, and I can feel it. Oh, I can feel it. So... Uh, let's see, baseball season has started. I'm excited. Some of y'all may know that I live in Texas, and I'm a huge Rangers fan. So, sorry for you guys that don't live in Texas, because we're going to beat you guys. All of you. And I think I'm going to raise the ceiling eventually, but for now I'm just going to have it three high. But... If I don't like feeling cramped, and three highs still feels a little cramped to me. You notice I've made everything else much taller than three. 
Even my bedroom is like four or five. Or four and a half, five and a half, I don't know. So let's count them. Okay, so half, one and a half, two and a half, three and a half, four and a half. Five if you count the... Let's just say five. There we go. Okay, so let's go gather or put away some of this stuff and we'll try and make an enchanting table. And I know for a fact I'm going to have to go gather some obsidian because I don't have any. And I know that you need obsidian. Oops. Do, 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 do. Wow, almost two stacks of gravel. Jeez. Okay, actually, first thing I need to do is make another diamond pick. Because if you uh, were watching my previous episode, you'll know that I broke a diamond pick while mining out the uh, tree farm area. Okay, so let me gather some food first. You guys may be wondering, is he OCD about his inventory? Maybe so, guys. Maybe so. Okay. Handy shortcut. And if you're wondering, I just put about 10 or 12 repeaters in a row to get a delay like that. On that uh, hidden piston, on the hidden trap door. Not a big deal, guys. We're just doing how we do. So, do, 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 do. You guys remember how long it used to take to mine bedrock? Or uh, obsidian? Oh, crap. I don't want that. Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay. Let us do this, I suppose. And hope that there's not any lava behind here. Actually, I've kind of like I've kind of enjoyed doing this lately, <laughs> having floor lighting, and then just covering it up so you can't walk in it. So, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, <laughs> oh no, 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 there we go. That's what I wanted to do. There we go. Just like nothing ever happened. Do, do, do. Oh, did I not? Oh, crap, crap, crap. Okay, there we go. Wait a minute. Why don't I, I only needed one piece? I just got <laughs> caught up in mining. Wow. Wow. Okay. Let us be gone. Be gone with you. So, we're, uh, what are we? Middle of April now? Oh, crap. Okay. Middle of April now. One of the summer movies that I'm looking forward to comes out soon. It's the, uh, the Avengers movie. I'm a huge nerd when it comes to that kind of stuff, so... I'm very excited. You guys should be too, if you know what's good for you. Uh, and of course, if you're not, it's cool. I'm just, I'm just pulling your legs. Okay. So how do we, how do we make an enchanting table? I'm thinking, since it has diamond on the corners, I'm either gonna need two or four diamond. Probably a book. And redstone? I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'll need five diamond. We'll see. Okay, so let's try obsidian. 
Diamond, 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 diamond. Book. Nope. Obsidian. Oh, shoot. You know what? Let's just go to the wiki right now. And I don't think you guys can see this on the film, which is probably good. Because it's not that exciting. Wiki, wiki, wiki. Crafting. And. Enchant. Where are you? Oh, it takes four obsidian. Crap. That's okay. I'll just go get one more piece. That's not a big deal. Right? That's funny that I was one piece short. Uh, figures. Just figures. Good thing I... Oh, jeez. Gotta be quick. <laughs> Got to be quick. Okay. I'm very excited about doing enchantments. I haven't ever done these before, so it'll be something new for me. Do 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 do. There we go. And let's cover you up. Okay. There we go. Got all that we needed. So let's go make ourselves a table. We can spend some of this XP. I can't remember. I think it's maybe level 5 or 10. Whenever you don't have any bookshelves next to the enchanting table. But we'll find out. That's the max level that you can enchant something. Sorry. I thought I said that, but I realized you guys are not in my head, so you don't know what I was thinking. Oh, <laughs> I have a funny story for you guys. So I was recording a uh, the Companions Challenge video that I told you guys about. I was recording that on my uh, computer. Not this computer that I'm on, but my other computer. <laughs> Believe it or not, my better and more capable computer. And um, I got about halfway through it, about 30 minutes in, and Minecraft crashed, and I was immediately taken to a blue screen of death. And that's only happened to me probably one other time uh, in Minecraft, and that was back in 2010, probably version 1.2.2 or 3 in the alpha stage. So I don't know what what it was. Maybe it was because Fraps was just bugging out or something, but anyways. Okay, here's our enchanting table. It looks pretty in this texture pack. Check it out. Woohoo! Okay, let's see what we can do. An enchanting diamond pickaxe. Now I hear that if you take cobblestone and... Nope. Cobblestone and left click? No. No. How do you do this? Well, I'm going to have to figure that out. But there's a trick to, to where you have, if, maybe if you have a full stack of cobblestone, you can just sit here and click on it and it'll go to the next level. Okay, so let's find... Actually, you know what? I'm, gonna, I'm not going to do that. What am I doing? I'm going to do it on a stone pick. I'm not going to do it on a diamond. Let's find a level 5. There we go. What's it going to be? Maybe Silk Touch? <gasps> Probably not. That only happens with uh, level 30 and above, I think. I'll take an efficiency one, though. Actually, let's do the sword. Fire aspect. That sounds fun. What's the shovel going to do? Level 4? Let's do that. Efficiency one. Okay. Cool. Let's try this out. Actually, you know what I can do? I can dig out the, the ceiling one more. Now that I've got my freaking awesome tools. And 
kind of do notice a little bit. Oh yeah, the sword, the shovel is definitely faster. The pickaxe is maybe a little bit faster. Nothing amazing or anything like that, but it's not bad. I mean, it's what you get what you pay for, right? Giggity giggity, giggity goo. But uh, anyways, it's a little bit faster. So I don't even know how long I've been recording for. Let me check the time real quick. Hang on. Okay, so it looks like I've been recording for about uh, 25 minutes or so. So I think I'll try and start wrapping it up. I like to keep these about 30 minutes just because, for one thing, some people have lunch breaks that they watch this on. and I know I watch movies on lunch break, and I only have 30 minutes for lunch, so I can appreciate it whenever a movie doesn't go over 30 minutes, or a video doesn't go over 30 minutes. So, anyways... Um, let me guys know what you think about this enchanting room. Um, I kind of think, I don't know, I've, I've had a couple ideas about the overall theme of the room. I kind of want to do either uh, a wooden theme, kind of like everything else, or maybe a nether brick slash nether brick stairs and rails maybe kind of theme. Um, let me know in the comments uh, which one you'd prefer I haven't done anything with the nether brick stuff so that might be the way it ought to go just to see how it looks but uh, I'm kind of excited about that um, the nether stuff the bricks and stuff look really good in this texture pack I think so I really haven't found anything in this texture pack I don't like so I like that I've tried to go back to default just to see what it's like and oh it hurts my eyes it hurts me. So, anyways, guys, I want to uh, thank you for watching. I don't really have much else to say, so I guess I'm just going to wrap this one up. Uh, next time, I don't know what we're going to do, but we can figure out something. Maybe we can... Uh, I'll probably show you what I've done on the pine tree part of the farm. Or the tree farm. And let's see, what else can we do? Do, 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 do. We need to start. Uh, we need to get back to our. Whatchamacallit? Our village sometime soon. Can't neglect those villagers for too long. They'll get unruly. So maybe we'll do that next time. But, uh, anyways, guys, I want to thank you for stopping by. Um, this has been a lot of fun. Um, enchanting my first items. Never done it before, so it was a lot of fun for me. Uh, glad you stopped by and let's do it again next time guys until then though I'll see you guys later and I'm going to keep digging see you guys <laughs>